But that Gravely Valley Road was my marker to, you know, if I hadn't turned on the video yet. Oh, there's Hancock County right there. Look at that. They have a neighborhood watch program in force. Be careful. Watch out. They'll get you. All right. So now we'll start the official windshield survey of Hancock County. You got a river. Well, actually, I'd probably call it a creek, but you got a creek right there. And a little house. Looks like it just rained here. There's another house. Mobile home or trailer. Got trees. Another house looked like it was run down. No one lived in it for a while. Okay, so oh, there's a big river here. All right, I can't, I don't remember the name of this river here, but this one, it goes all along the side of the mountain there. And uh, when I come back, um, I'll be riding along that river there. So uh, we'll get a better view of it. And it looked like on uh, Google Maps that there was a whole bunch of farmland along the side of it. So you know, we'll we'll get to see that hopefully. But it still looks uh, pretty hilly in this area here and uh, undeveloped. Um, you know, there's a couple houses, or, and this is a conservatory center and a retreat. All right, and once we get past this uh, bridge here, this is uh, Kyle's crossing, Kyle's Ford. There you go. Okay. It's a wildlife management area. Alrighty. Now I want to take 33, which should be around here somewhere. 33 south. Yep, keep going straight. Oh, they rent canoes there. That'd be awesome. 33. Alright, I'm taking this one right here. And this idiot behind me hopefully doesn't ram me because they've been tailgating me the whole time. All right, so here we are, 33, we'll go 33 to Fox Branch Road, okay? So if you guys see Fox Branch Road, holler, though probably by that time it'll be too late and I'll we'll already passed it. Okay, okay, that Palace Ford School does not look like it's in business, looks like a daycare center here. And this all looks like it's farmland, but uh, it's, it's kind of hard to tell if it's been cultivated recently. Um, the, uh, you know, it might be the time of the season where you just let it, uh, you know, grow a wild crop in order to uh, bring the nutrients back into the soil. But there's some houses there and school bus sign I almost nailed and more houses and hills this would probably be a very hard area to farm just because of the amount of hills that you have yeah some older barns, uh, houses, they still look like they're in use, so, you know, people still live there, it looks like, but it's not in a good state of repair. Um, and some mobile homes, and there's a river there, or a small creek bed, it looks like. Guys in a hurry. 
down here. Alright, so fire truck station. Looks like right over there, the wood building. Um, flags that half staff, not sure what for, but it, it looks like it's probably a volunteer building, so yeah, not fully staffed at, all the time. Alright, uh, Fox Branch, mm, nope. I have not seen any speed limit signs on this road, so I'm not sure how fast the speed limit is, but it basically seems to be going pretty fast. That was it. Uh, Alright, so we're going to make a U-turn up ahead here as soon as I can. And come back along that road there. Alrighty. Now to find a safe place to make a U-turn. Alright, that looks like a decent place there. Well, this is... Alright, here's a road here. Make a U-turn here. Oh no, I'm on the grass. I'm on the grass. Okay. I'm gonna stretch a little bit here. Oh my gosh. Yep, stock seat still on the still on the bike here, so not the most comfortable thing in the world, but it works. Alright, so it's up near these little houses. I don't know if you guys noticed, but you see the uh, cattail uh, right around, well they're off to the side a little bit, so, but they usually only grow where there's a lot of water, so either it's a, a drainage ditch, a small creek, or I would guess that it, it could be a, a irrigation channel uh, set up to, uh, to uh, help uh, irrigate the fields here. And of course I get stuck with this guy coming in. Alright. So here we are on Fall Branch Road. We are going to Back Valley Road. Speed limit 35 and has a whole bunch of bullet holes in it so people have been practicing shooting from their car. It's awesome. Oh, a little doggy up there sleeping. I woke him up. He's going to get upset. Alright. So there's a little creek right there. And this is a, this is a nice house right here. And this is right near a mountain. As you can tell. And over here. 
So this must be a small valley that they've, uh, you know, cultivated a little bit. These do look like fields here, but, you know, again, it must not be the season. And that truck I don't think is going to be moving anytime soon. Nor are those 15 cars there. Or are these cars here? This is a cute little area though. Got a little river and... Yeah. Little houses there. Now that's kind of scary right there. Oh look, I guess two little doggies. Yeah. And I'm guessing that's an outhouse. So maybe, maybe some limited, uh, there's a graveyard up there. But you know, the outhouse, there might be some limited uh, piping or, or you know, uh, plumbing uh, facilities. So. Uh oh, there's a little beagle. Good thing he didn't chase me. I have to put him down. Oh, whole bunch of gravel there. <laughs> Scared the the Jesus out of me that time. Almost. Uh... <laughs> yeah. My stomach is like up in my throat about right now just because of the, that little bit of gravel there. So again, uh, haven't seen any cultivated crops just yet. I think it's uh, out of season. But uh, you would think that you would still see some uh, uh, fields that were just harvested since it's been a kind of a you know nice summer you know the, the growing growing season should be extended and actually there's a little bit right there it looks like they're growing something there so you know they, they may have harvested it a little bit a little bit ago and all right so I think this is our crossroad here we, let's get to the stop sign Well, I don't know. I guess that's a stop. There was a sign there, so I'm gonna take a left here. And these one, these fields here look like they're a bit more managed, maintained. It almost looks like they have uh, hedgerows. Like over in Europe, you know, with the trees there. They don't look as built up, but, you know. And it looks like there's barbed wire fence or an electrical fence there. So I wonder if they keep livestock. All right, next road is... Oh, actually back on, left on to 33 when I see it. And I think that's actually, this this road here, I think will take me into Sneedville. So, I'll probably stop in Sneedville and get some lunch.
I guess this is the car, oh, Bobby's used car. Kind of different. I, I don't know if I'd want, want some of those used cars. But maybe he parts them out. So. There's a cemetery here. It looks like it's well kept up. Let's see. There's the mountain there. Cattle crossing, okay, so they do keep cattle here, but uh, I'm not sure where. Maybe up on the higher fields there. Or maybe they sent them to uh, the slaughterhouse. Now if you look at these fences, they have little water bags or little bottles full of water and I think I've been told that that keeps some insects away, so oh, there's some cows there. Yeah. But uh, hey cow, there's a boy, he's checking me out, he's coming after me. Yeah. But uh, you know, the water there, the way that the light reflects through it, you know, it uh, uh, bothers the insects or something and keeps them away from it so yeah. that I have no idea what that is so. I guess it's wood that they've made like a an igloo out of wood or a wood pile so that that's interesting I guess I guess it, you know it's a maybe no central heating and so they use the wood that much wood during the summer or during the winter I guess but Man, that was a lot of wood. Try and get this guy to pass me just so I can take my time looking around. But <clears throat> still looks like there's some, oh, there's some goats there. But still farmland. stop sign here I don't remember this stop sign on the map
Okay, we're gonna go straight. Ugh. Yeah, I think... No, this isn't 33 yet, but... It's a nice house. Got a nice Pontiac G6 in the garage there. So we're in Sneedville. And there's more cows. And farmland. This looks like a uh, some sort of county building here, just as the flag. And let's see if there's a sign. Nope, actually someone's house. I'm pretty surprised. The house is uh, about uh, let's see. 16 cents higher than in Johnson City there. There's a Pepsi truck. Zoo. The Catholic Church right there. The self storage area looks like. There are a lot of cars just like all over the place just sitting on the you know run down and you know I'm not sure how they all got here I mean do they do the people here really go through that many cars or is it just uh, you know they buy them and part them out okay so I think this is the county school and 20 miles an hour Home of the Indians. Oh. Hancock County High School. So right here on your left. Oh, it's high school and middle school. So combined there. Got an obstacle up here. It's the horse. The horse is the obstacle. See it there? It's a nice looking horse. I, I think, uh oh, that horse there wanted to go meet the other horse. That's what it was. Either that or he just left from there. So. We got some corn growing over here. It looks like a small field. Maybe a personal use. Probably not enough to sell. Uh, bunch of houses. New car. Let's say Ford Taurus. Nice. And I'm guessing that's a truck entering highway sign. 
That was the drop-in center, it said, which is a, a, it was a division of Frontier Health, so Frontier Health does do, you know, medical, uh, mental services, so they do have that here. New tractor supply store, looks like. Nice. Now the way that the Google Maps pictured it, or what I pictured from Google Maps was that it is a little bit, uh, okay, here's the medical center, so we're going to just do a quick swing by here and take a look. A division of Rural Health Services Incorporated. So I don't know if this is considered the county health department or if it's just a small little uh, like urgent care clinic. But it's right along the main road here. These ones look pretty nice, you yeah. know. Good repair. There's a library down that way, it says, which looks like it's one of those two buildings right there. Looks like maybe a, the. Actually, uh, is it Willow Street that the. Okay, hospital. Hancock County Hospital is right there. I don't know if you can see it too well. There's the Family Dollar, Pizza Plus, Dollar General. <clears throat> so this is, must be downtown Sneedville here. There's the Rite Aid and a traffic light. Oh, there's two traffic lights. <laughs> and obviously a guy doesn't see a motorcycle coming out in front of him. Either. Therefore, he pulls out in front of me. All right. Oh, yeah, Hardy's boy. Yeah. We're going to Hardy's. The bacon, bacon biscuit. Oh, snap. I think it's a little bit too late for lunch, breakfast, but we'll go in here and get some lunch.